Test, test, test. Oh, yeah. Test, 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 test. Test. Yeah. Do I have to worry about it anymore if it's... Hello, hello.
Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Upper Dublin Boys Varsity Volleyball versus the Central Bucks East Patriots. And today it looks like our starting lineup will be number 24, Corey Pendleton, number 16, Seamus Frain, number 18, Potter Rudel, number 3, Zach Brown, number 5, Scott Barenbaum, number 29, Joey Theodorson, and our libero, number 10, Dom Placu. Something that jumps out to me right off the bat is number 18, Potter Rudel, is in. Normally, he is a swing, so he plays JV and varsity. So I'm interested to see what he's going to do starting varsity. Number three, Zach Brown, about to kick it off for us. And an ace right off the bat. Way to start it off. Back to serve. Great serve. And it's up. Push. Great pickup by Zach. Back to serve. Oh, right into that. That would have been a great serve if it went over. No float, no, no spin, excuse me. No spin, really low. Would have been great if it went over. <laughs> Number 22, up to serve for the Patriots. Goes for a top spin. Great pickup by number 10. Don Placu up to serve. Great serve. Oh, great pickup by the setter. Just hit out by number 35 on the other team. That was a great play by number 22 up at the net. The libero passed it straight into the net. Looks like the play was over. Number 22 managed to pull it off the net. Great play. Fortunately, number 35 sailed that one out of bounds. Nice serve, great pass. Right off the block, great pickup, out of system, UD. Oh, great attempt by Libero, sailed a little too far out of bounds. Great serve, just in. Looks like CB East thought I was heading out. They both dodged the ball right as they were going up for it. Great pass, uh, it's up, boom, blocked. CBS picks it back up, a little dink by number 29, Theo Dorson. Oh. Great play by UD there, really great block. But fortunate play from... S 
so it's kind of hard to see right now, but there's a pretty big crowd here for Upper Dublin, and a lot of them are holding red pom-poms, so we love to see people showing up for the games. Don Plaku still up to serve. CBs just called a timeout because they're down 7-1 right now. Maybe trying to ice number 10 out, trying to make him miss a serve. Great pass. Good pickup by the setter, number five. Great pop up by Pendleton. Wow, what a great play by Upper Dublin. Both teams over there were trying to keep it pretty controlled. They weren't really taking any risks. A lot of roll shots, just trying to get it over the net. But UD scored the point when they hit it hard. CBE's first earned point, their first point, I believe, came from a service error. Great play, great service, Steve. Managed to hit it off the block, out of bounds. Short serve, Plaku is there. Oh. Great play, standard play. Beautiful pass from the libero. Yes, Michael Luce is up to serve. Great serve. Wow, I don't know. Wow. Great hustle from number 29 on UD. The way to keep that ball up. And unfortunate for CB East hitting that straight into the net. They could have, that was a great chance for them to score. Great, another great serve. Oh, that was interesting. <laughs> Loose up the serve. Great serve, nice pick up to the outside, bang, picked up, great dig. Little push, keeping it in, oh, and they get the kill off of that. That wasn't the best set, but number three, Zach Brown, knew how to deal with, deal with it, put in a great spot, deep corner, so right above defender and one, so there's a little miscommunication there. Great spot, great play. Another great serve. Up. Oh, another push, but too easy to read. Oh. And it looks like there was a, just like an off hit from little misconnection from the setter and the middle there. But UD got the point because CB East um, committed an error there. Blocker, I believe, went too far over the net, which you're not allowed to do. Oh, great serve. Wow, great hustle from the libero, diving one hand. And unfortunately, it's not enough. CBS lost the point on that because they had four touches, weren't able to get it over in three, but that was great hustle from that libero. 
Luce is on a run right now with these incredible serves. Oh, tape. Wow. What a play right there. Oh. And it looks like CB East got the point there. Um, from what I saw, I thought the CB East blockers touched the ball and then it went out. But I guess the refs saw something different. But great pickup, perfect pass. Blocked, pickup, recycle. Oh. That was unfortunate. Set was a little too far outside. Pendleton tried to do what he could to wrap around the ball without hitting it into the antenna, but it wasn't enough. Set was too far out. Number 31 on CB East, back to serve. Tight pass. Oh. Little bit of a tight pass. Setter tried to jump set that there to get it off the net, but just, just a little too low for Theo Dorson to do anything about that. Oh, that was a lucky serve. Went right over the net, off the hands. And tip straight into the block. Third one back to serve again. A little off of a pass. Free ball over. Oh, but the setter took the first ball. That was unfortunate right there. CBs had the perfect chance to earn a point. They got a free ball, but unfortunately, their setter took the first ball, so they were unable to set the second one. And whoever took a second hands over there just wasn't a good enough set, and that hitter sailed it out of bounds. Pendleton up to serve. Great serve, nice pass, a little tight, tip into the block. What a block by number five, Berenbaum. Pendleton up to serve again. Great serve, a great short serve. What a pickup by Lobero, blocked, over, sent over. Don Plaque, who gets the ball? Pendleton up to hit, hit the block, it's still up. Oh, free ball, oh! Wow, that was a great rally. Really unfortunate how that one ended with a miscommunication on what should have been a free ball for UD. But what a great play. What a great play. Pelton up to serve again. Nice pickup to right side. Boom, straight down. Great hit. Looked like that one got through the block a little bit. Great hit. Maybe this is CBE starting to pick up some steam. Oh, tops it, oh, that one, pretty far out of bounds. From what the server was doing, it looked like he was gonna hit a top spin, but his contact ended up making it a float serve that just floated way out of bounds. Theodorson up to serve, let's see what he's got. Under the net, oh wow, everybody's reactions, oh my. Uh, I believe head coach Paul Choi is laughing at him right now and making fun of him. Um, I'm not sure if Upper Dublin has this rule, but uh, if Upper Dublin boys volleyball has the rule, but for the girls team, if you serve the ball underneath the net, you owe the entire team brownies. So I wonder if the Adorson owes the boys team brownies now. He looks a little disappointed himself. We have number we have two new subs subbed in. Potter Rudel, number 18, subs in, and number 19, Sebastian Isaac, sub, subs in. Michael Luce is out, Seamus Frain back in. Oh, looks like Scott Berenbaum is coming out for Charlie Watt, number 13. I believe Upper Dublin believes they have this set in the bag, so they're putting in some of their bench players right now. Let's see what Watt has up. Oh, what a great serve. Right over the net. Great pop up from number 22. Oh. Great hit by 
Number 19, Sebastian Isaacs, right through the block. Great hit. Great serve, a little topspin to them, making it drop a little faster. Oh, great block. Great hustle, another one-hander. CBS gets the ball over this time. Nice set. Oh. It looks like there was, so from CB side, they, they had a hole in the block. And I'm assuming Frayne number 16 saw that, so he was aiming for it. Unfortunately, he didn't get on top of the ball enough. He hit it a little too far out of bounds. Libero number 21 up to serve. Nice pass. Back row, Pendleton, wow! What a hard hit, it's still up. What a great dig from that libero. What a great pursuit from number 22, their setter. Oh, into the net. That was, so, that point belongs to the libero right there, digging that monster of a hit. Great job, number 21. Another serve. Oh, targeting number 16 on the serve. That was, I'm really impressed on how number 16 Frayne dealt with that serve. He normally doesn't pass a lot, but great pass. Oh wait, never mind. Number 16 normally doesn't pass, but now he is. And I'm, oh, <laughs> set or dump. Wow, number 35, he got up high, but hit the ball straight down, straight into the net. Number 19, Sebastian Isaac up to serve. Oh, great serve. Looks like a free ball, oh, it's a roll shot. Nice pickup, another right side hit, a little dink. Straight to the defender, another power tip. Still up, let's see, little tight, oh my gosh. What a hit. That's what happens when you give Pendleton a tight ball. That was a little tight to the net, but he just slammed it down CB East throat. Oh, lucky serve, went over the net. Tip, hit, let's see, oh. Nice play by CV East, way to see that opening with the tip right there. Way to go Watt getting a hand on it. Maybe a little faster he would have gone it. that would have been great for UD. 22-13. Let's see if CV East can do something here. Nice pass, another right side, off the block, oh. Great block by CB East. Pendleton tried to cover that by getting a hand on it. Just wasn't enough. Watt is really liking this right side set. He said it like four times so far in the last few plays. Great hand pass. Perfect pass. Setter doesn't even have to move. Little misconnection. Little Potter had to dink that over. Oh! Oh my gosh, still up. Way to go. What an amazing pickup. Off the block. Come on. Bang! Straight down, wow. Incredible play right there. Incredible pursuit. Love to see that from Upper Dublin, even when they're up 23 to 14, still giving 100% to every play. And Pendleton crushing it, incredible. Penalty, um, Plaku up to serve. Great pass by the libero. Whoa, wow, nice hit. That was a really solid play from CB East. Perfect pass, great hit, great spot. Watt needs to stay, um, needs to stay a little bit closer to the tee on the court. He was leaving that a lot of space open right there. Standing really far in. Little dink, per oh, little pop over. Whoa, that was an, in I didn't see that call coming. Looks like the ref thought that Watt's hand went over the net. Um, 
and you're not allowed to do that when you're back row, I believe. Great pass. Little tip. Great finesse shot off the hands of the blockers. Little dink, little tip right into the blocker's hands, going right out of bounds. Loose back in a serve. Let's see what he got. Let's see if he can take CB out, CB East out right now. Oh. Serve, great pass, and oh my gosh. Amazing way to end the set, 25-17 UD Cardinals. Honestly, I'm pretty impressed with CB East from the beginning of the start of the game, started out 7-1. And I thought it was going to stay at a pretty big deficit the entire time. But they managed to kind of keep themselves in it 25-17. And it's really interesting. I, CB East actually has pretty good serve receive. But their hits are just aren't connecting. They keep on hitting out of bounds or into the net. But incredible serve receive. Great job by that libero commanding the backcourt on serve receive. Ellie, Ellie, yeah, Ellie. Okay, talk how you're gonna normally talk. And there goes. Okay, <laughs> welcome back everybody to our second set, UD Boys Volleyball versus CB East Patriots. I'm, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Elisa Zhang, and I'm joined with a new guest, Ellie Schaefitz, ninth grade specialist. <laughs> there are no freshmen on this team actually. UD is a very old team. We have a lot of 
We have a lot of seniors and a lot of um, juniors. Some of the players are Scotty, Gabe, Dom, Seamus, Corey, and okay, do, Zach. Do play by play. Up to serve, number 93, 22. <laughs> and Gabe goes in with the hit. Oh, oh. And Zach digs it. Oh, and Scotty oh. almost picks it up with a tough shot. That was a great dig by number three, Zach Brown. Unfortunately, it went into the net, and UD was not able to pick it back up. But... Here we go again, back at it. Number 22 serves. And Corey Pendleton picks it up. Gabe spikes into oh. the net. Gabe hit it into, number seven, Gabe Copley hit into the net. He steps into the game. He's normally a starter, but he did not start last set. He's starting the set now. So let's he see what he's benched. got. Yes, he was benched. <laughs> Corey digs it. I mean, receives it. Oh, little dink. And they get it back after a touch, and Corey tries to spike it, and he continues with a W. Great play by Pendleton. For the first ball, he was playing middle. Oh. Just uh. kidding. April Fools. <laughs> and Madison Small has my donut. Looks like our line ref over there, Ben Bokul, wanted to make a, the call in favor of UD, but... His, his honor and good heart couldn't lie. Oh my God. Number 22, back up to serve. Oh, great oh, serve. And take by Zach Brown. And spiked by Corey Pendleton. Out it goes. UD starting a little. I am very hungry and waiting for my donut. Okay, shut up. UD starting a little bit. UD is starting a little bit slow right now. The first set they were up 7-1 and now they're down 0-4. It is currently 4-0. It's been a lot of hits miss hits hits. and errors on UD right now. Great pass by Pendleton. Oh! And Gabe Copley! And right as I say that. Right as I say that, Copley shuts CB East down. What a great hit. Tick, tick, boom. Oh, I'm so sorry for that. I said I was hungry. <laughs> You're always and eating. Troy over there on the bench does not look very fond. <laughs> Troy, 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 Troy. Oh, I'm gonna turn your mic off. <laughs> oh, Lou Spike hits it, serves it. And into the net it goes by CB East. And it looks like CB East is, might be starting their uh, little trend they had last set where they just keep on hitting it into the net or out of bounds. Luce gets up to serve. You don't have to hold it like that. And he floats it right over the net. Ooh. Oh. Shane Shine misses it, but with a touch. Nice play by CB East. You know, one thing I noticed, Ellie, is that they have really good serve receive. CB East has great serve receive, but they just can't connect on their hits, so which is. Dominic Black who? Which is and a pretty big disappointment. Received by Dom. Received by Dom. And Zach takes it. Zach Brown takes the kill. Great hit. Um, the setter 22 on CB East. He was actually right there for the hit, but it's a pretty hard hit. Unfortunately, he couldn't pick it back up. Plaku is up to serve. And he spins it a little bit. Sets and... Oh. Touch, 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 over the net. Oh, number 22 should have been there to get that one. Is number 35 a lefty? He just hit that ball lefty, but I, he's been hitting outside for most of the game, so that's pretty surprising if he is a lefty and, he just, and he's been hitting outside because generally you don't see lefties at outside. You see them and at right side. And he again with a spinner. And out of system, out of system, and they make it over. Loose digs it with a attempt. Oh. oh. I don't know what happened there. That was a little unfortunate. <laughs> oh. That was a that was a great serve. They got a nice roll shot over, which was basically a free ball. Perfect pass, but Barenbaum tried to go back to 
number 16, Frayne. I guess he tripped on his feet. Up, little roll shot. There's some beautiful woman here. 23, right there. 23, back to dink it over. Dug by loose. And an outside hit. Another throw. A little push. Oh. So, Lisa, Lisa, what do you think? How do you think that UD is playing today? I think that they're not being aggressive and they're not using the skills that Troy has taught them. I think uh, you. I, I think you're right. I see a lot of um, unaggressive hits right now. I see a lot of dinks, but I think pushes, little dinks and pushes and tips. But I think that comes from. Dog by loose. But I think that comes from setting, so it's not completely the hitter's fault. And of course, setting comes from passing. So. And we just lost the point. I I believe that. As some of you might know, Peak Elite is a very common team here. And yesterday at practice, we learned, we worked a lot on balance. I think Frank um, needs a little bit of that. Okay. Stop talking and about our club team. And he hits it down. Oh. Good job, Brown. That was a little roll shot. It was nice, light, and easy. But it was a great spot. It went right between number 12 and number easy, 21 breezy, seams. Lamb, squeezy. So there's a little communication error. Nobody really went for it. So great job on number three for Zach Brown for putting it at such a great spot, deep corner, right between the seams. Beautiful serve oh. by Woo! Looks like number 12 on CBE tried to take it with his hands, but he caught it too low. Three, two, one. Great serve, got them, got them the overpass. Number 29, Theo Dorson was right there, ready to dink it over. Well, this is Ellie Shapin, and I'm signing out. Good night, UD. Go convince Jason. Can you go over and convince Jason so I can try? Enjoy. Unfortunately, Ellie has left us. <laughs> there, there she is right there. And it looks like a little bit of substitution mishaps are going on. Oh, no. Michael Luce is playing front row. They didn't sub fast enough for Pendleton to get in. He is front row, I'm wondering if they're gonna go. Oh my gosh. I really wanna see, oh, I really wish they set loose. Oh, that was an incredible dig, great technique. Man, I really wish that CB East got a hit on, got it, got a great, a good pass so they could have set their outside so Luce would have had to block. That would have been, that would have been hilarious. Oh, great spot. Oh, the passer over there, CB East. He just wasn't able to angle his platform to the setter properly, so it went off the court. Great pursuit from CB East to try and bring it back, just wasn't enough. Another good pass from the libero. Oh, wow. Eh. What a play. John Plaku picking up the little miss hit. Those ones are really hard to get. Miss hits are always hardest ones to get. Always a little weird. And Pendleton with the finesse. Love to see it. Oh, great dig. Free ball for CBs. And it's tight. Pendleton up to hit it. Free ball, oh, roll shot over. Great roll shot. Pendleton hit. Way to finish that, what a great play. And I forgot to mention, Upper Dublin is now back in the lead, 12-9. Really picking up speed. Nice pass by CB East. And a little, it was, it was a kill for sure, but it was a little off speed. So, you know what, they, they still got the kill. Oh, 
Great pass. Up and Frain is the hit. Out. Frain is not having the best night right now. Great pass, though. Both these teams are really solid at service Eve. Most important skill in the game. High ball. Up and... Oh, my gosh. Wow. Another kill by Pendleton. Theodore sent up to serve. If you recall, his last serve went straight under the net. Oh. You know, this one's a little better. This one didn't go under the net. This one went into the net. So he's getting up there. Maybe the next serve is going to go over. Brain up to serve. Great pass. Nice kill by number 33. That was a really fast offense they just ran. I didn't realize they ran it that fast, but it looked like a one ball to me. So the set, the hitter was hitting the ball like right after the setter set it. Oh, looks like a misconnect. It was a nice pass. Everybody could tell it was gonna go to Copley, but either he was a little late or the set was a little high and they just missed it. Oh, wow. Wow, what a, what a block by number 33. That actually gives CV East the lead, 15-14. This game is actually really close right now. Wow, that might give CV East a lot of momentum heading into the second half of this set. What a block. That block went straight down. Another roll by Frain. Wow, what a dig. Incredible job by Libero. Oh. Wow, what a dig by the libero, number 21 on CBE side. He's a really standout player, great defense. He's gotten a few really, really solid digs off of some incredibly hard hits, and his service receive is incredible. Another hitting error by CB East. Number 35 right there is looking a little frustrated. Upper Dublin takes the lead 16-15. Loose up to serve. Great serve. Nice pass by the libero. Right into the block. Nice cover by the setter. Little looks like a little roll shot. Jump. Another roll shot. Oh, what a pickup. Looks like that one just went a little bit out of bounds. One thing I've been noticing is Upper Dublin's playing it pretty safe. Some of their Upper Dublin's hitters are playing it pretty safe right now. A lot of, you're seeing a lot of roll shots. But that could also be because maybe the hitter doesn't like their set that much. Short serve. Oh, classic case of the middle getting in the setter's way. That pass went really high up in the middle of the court. Um, so Barenbaum should have had an easy time getting to it, but it's just in the way. Copley was in the way. Into the net, tie game right now. Blacku up to serve. Outside, into the block. Wow, what a nice block. 
Great job, number 29, Theodore Sin. Another hitting error from CB East. That's absolutely killing them right now. They're hitting errors. It's just hitting's looking a little sloppy from their side. Out of. Oh. That was unlucky right there. You could tell Loose thought it was number one. Loose thought that was heading out. So he tried to let it go, but it caught his hand as it was going out of bounds. This is actually a really tight game right now. Great pass. Oh, what? Okay, looks like uh, number three, Brown, hit it into the block, and now they're trying to decide if that the ball went in or out. The line ref over there was saying it's out. Line... Uh, the referee is saying it was in, and they changed the call. It was out. Another nice pass. Um, you can tell every time they have a good pass, they always try to run that middle. And UD was actually able to get a block up. Wow. UD was actually able to get a block up on the middle, but they just keep on getting kills. Really nice job from the middles at CB East. That was an interesting serve, a really aggressive standing topspin. You don't see that a lot. Normally, it's either a standing float, jump float, or jump topspin. Oh, CB East is mad. Line ref um, over there was saying it was out. CB East clearly doesn't agree. But that was a great pass by number 12 over there service on service Eve. Another great pass. And to the block. Theodore Dorsten is on fire with these blocks tonight. He's picked up like at least three. Free ball, Upper Dublin. There we go. Nice hit right down the line. 20, that ends the set, 25-19. Not that much closer, not much that, the score isn't that much different from the first set, actually. First set was 25-17, and which is pretty impressive because at the beginning, it was a really tight match up until about 20, 18, so Upper Dublin went on a 6-1 and one run.
So now we're heading into the third set. So let's see if Upper Dublin can close it out. And a similar score that they've done for the last two sets. Or if CB East fights back and takes the set from Upper Dublin. I'm really interested to see if UD does something different with their lineup, and it looks like they are because number eight, Ryan Stokes, I believe, is stepping onto the court for the first time tonight. So since they are switching up the lineup, I wonder if CB East can capitalize on that and maybe take the set from Upper Dublin. Looks like Luce is our first sub server for Upper Dublin, which makes a lot of sense. He's been having a really good night on his serves. All his serves are really low, fast, and no spin on them. Nice pass by Libero. Oh, CBE strikes first. Great pass from Libero. Nice hit right off the hands, out of bounds. Point CB East. Great pass. Crowd's going a little crazy for that kill right there from number eight, Stokes. Nice little roll shot. Way to see the opening in uh, CB's defense. Caught them a little when they're staying a little deep. Oh! Libero from CB's just got ace. Uh, didn't think I'd see that tonight. He's been really good on service Eve the entire time. But it was a hard serve because it hit the tape of the net, which changes it. Oh, another one. Great job from Don Plaku to spot that number 21 struggling and to serve at him, target him. Great serve from number our libero to CB East libero. And he's going at him again. But CB East libero handles it this time. Oh, great pickup by Luce. Tip. Oh, oh my gosh. 
Wow, what a great pickup. No. Oh my gosh. Hit out of bounds. Wow. Pendleton, so Pendleton tips it into the block. He, I'm pretty sure he wasn't sure if it was going in or out, so he kicks it up. Doesn't really, that kick doesn't really do much, but Plaku comes flying in with and picks it up. Oh, great serve. Real tip. Great up by Plaku. Oh. Barenbaum was right there. I, he just couldn't get to it. Nice serve. That was a great serve. Little deep dish set, and it's out. Wow. This. Another great serve. Oh. Way to go, Pendleton, getting through the block on his hit. Number 35 was pulling out some great serves right there. Really hard, fast serves, really hard to deal with. Top spin. A little off. Number 18, Paul Rulo gets uh, one of his first kills of the night. Oh, under the net. Great pass. Twenty-four, num number twenty-four, Corey Pendleton. He's such a great hitter. It feels like he can hit like he can basically hit any set. That one was a really high. N that, one, that set from Bear Murray, there was a really nice high set. Managed to kill it. Low sets, Pendleton can kill it. Great serve, got the free ball back. Back row hit right through the block. Right over, jump set. Ah, oh, hit out. We have number 11, Victor Che subbing in. Oh, nice serve. Way to go, number 23 from CB East, tooling off the block. Victor Che comes out, Potter, Brutal back in, and Back out again for the libero. One thing I noticed from CB East is that they, their biggest weakness, one of their biggest weaknesses is covering those short balls. They got caught a lot on tips, a lot on those short roll shots, and a lot on covering hits that come off the block. They need to stay on their feet more. Oh, great one-hand set. Oh. Oh. Nice try from 29 to number 8 on our side, trying to pick that ball back up. But got caught on the short ball. Another jump top spin. This one's short. Little, that set was a little inside and off the net. 
Blocked. That set was a little low, a little tight. Theodorson hit it right into the block. Another drop top spin, another really short one. Really short serve. Oh, wow. Love the hustle from Brown trying to get that one over. Great set. Oh, free ball. Wow. Another. Number 33 is having a great night right now. He's got a few kills, lots of blocks. Again, CB East on that really fast offense from the middle. Great set. Currently 10-9 right now uh, for CB East. They are up by one. CB East managed to keep that one alive. And <laughs> Corey Pendleton with the left hand still getting the kill, tooling it off the block. Really impressive, considering he's right-handed. <laughs> Little tip. Oh, wow, great pickup by the libero, Don Plaku. CB East gets a free ball. Let's see what they do here. Oh, and blocked. Unfortunately, on that one, it looks like CB East, when they got the free ball, they couldn't run their middle because their middle didn't transition far back enough. Oh, little tip, great pickup, sent back over. Let's see what they do here. Push, come on, up. Oh! Great hustle play from Upper Dublin. A lot of, lot of diving one hand pop-ups. See that a lot in boys volleyball. Diving with one hand, trying to scoop the ball up. Girls normally try to, instead of doing that, they try to slide their hand flat under it and have the ball hit their hand instead of the floor. That's called a pancake. Oh! Ace for CB East. Didn't expect that. Wasn't the hardest serve, but run right through uh, Plaku and Lucis Seams. Wouldn't expect that to happen to the Libero on the DS. A little unfortunate. Let's see how they get this one back. And that one goes out. Great pass by the libero. Try to run that offense again. Whoa! That one, that one looked like a carry to me. And Upper Dublin isn't happy about it either. You can tell by them trying to make the call. That one looks like the. Oh, interesting. Oh wow. <laughs> Number 35 is mad. That was a hard serve. That would have been incredible if that went over. Brain back in, Stokes is out. Great pass. Oh. That hit went kind of over the shoulder of Brown, 
Uh, would have been a better ball if Seamus got his hand on that one. Another tight game right now. Fifth CB East up 15 to 14, but this is what happened last set and last set, Upper Dublin won 25 to 19, I believe. Oh, what happened? No hustle on that play. That one would have been an easy ball to pick up. I don't, probably a miscommunication between 24 and 16. Both of them probably thought the other one was going for it. Solid play from Upper Dublin. Victor Che, number 11, back in to serve as a serving specialist. Serving specialist up to serve. Serving specialist means you only come in to serve, and then once you're done serving and once the team wins the other point, you get subbed back out. Let's see what he's got here. Oh, some miscommunication with the line ref and ref over there is going on. Let's just get this game moving. 16-16. Great serve, low right over the net. Great pickup. Oh, wow. That one was a hard ball. That hit rolled rolled around on the tape, so it made a really sharp angle, really, really hard to pick up, especially with the defense Upper Dublin is running right now with um, their outside pinching in a lot for defense, leaving that gap open. Nice pass. Great hit, Zach Brown, sealing the deal on that one. Still a tied game. Let's see who is gonna end up pulling away on this one. Barenbaum, number five, up to serve. Oh, what a great serve. Going red. Oh! Thea Dorson tried to go with the one-hand block over there. Didn't really work out. CV's point. Number 34, their middle is up to serve. They don't have a middle right now, so let's see how their defense is going to do without a libero. Top spin. Oh, really short serve. Oh, great pickup. Oh, wow, what a great serve. Top spin, short serves, always tricky to get. CB East gets the overpass, middle's right there to slam back down. Let's see if he does it again, yep. This time Pendleton's more ready for it. Oh! Looks like Stokes number eight over there. He tried to go high hands, which means you try to purposely hit it high into the blocker's hands so it sails out of bounds after touching the blocker so you get the point. Another short serve, yep. That one went a little deeper. Oh, a little miscommunication up there on the seam. 21-17, CV East is up. I believe this is CV East, uh, one of CV East's biggest leads they've had the entire night. A few miscommunications, few tight passes can shift the game completely. Another short, oh, this one's going deep. That one looked like it could have been out, but it's a hard one. Tip. Oh, CB picks it up. Their middle picks up the tip. Oh, wow. CB East was struggling this entire night on those short tips. I'm really impressed. Their middle, number 34, managed to pick up the tip. Great read. Way to be there. Unfortunately, CB East, again with the hitting errors, hit it into the net. 
loose up to serve. This is Upper Dublin's starting server, so let's see how CBS can deal with that. Serves it at the libero. It's a little off. Roll shot. Will Upper Dublin score here? Going to Frayne. Little roll shot. CBS gets the ball back. Little roll shot. Roll shot after roll shot here. Let's see if Pendleton seals the deal. Wow! What a great dig. Oh! Ne oh, oh. Oh, that was. That was a bad call. Oh, okay, they reversed it. Really great hit by Pendleton. If he didn't grab the net on the way down, he clearly grabbed the net. Coach Paul Choi calls a timeout. 22 18. I did not expect CB East to be up by four this late into the game. Oh, the ref is uh, trying to get the score table's attention, but I guess they don't have that much experience running it. Wow. Way to go, CB East. And UD is out of the huddle first. Let's see how UD recuperates after that. Let's see, let's see if they can climb back and sweep CB East, or if CB East wins the set and continues the game. For CB East, it's a race to three points. For Upper Dublin, uh, at least they're a race to 24 to tie to make it at least a win by two. Another really short serve. Oh, wow. That is an ace for CB East. They're up 23. That is their biggest win, uh, biggest lead of the night. Wow. They are killing Upper Dublin on these short serves. Oh, a little off right over. Oh, Upper Dublin gets the free ball despite giving a little off. Oh, let's see if they can, ah. Oh. Pendleton with the kill. 23 gets his hands on it, but it just goes a little too far. Great pursuit from CB East. Players though, just weren't able to get to it in time. Plaku up to serve. Let's see if he can bring Upper Dublin back. Oh, wow. Wow. That was an incredible block. Oh, Berenbaum is down. Oh my gosh. What a play. Great serve by Plaku. Way to get the overpass. And great job middle blocker over at CB East side from blocking the overpass kill. Great pass by the libero. Let's see if they can run that middle. Oh, wow. Plaku is there for that. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't be surprised if CB East calls a timeout right now. Wow. Way to go, Plaku, for picking up that incredibly fast middle ball. That middle is really close to carrying the ball by like dragging it straight down. Always so hard to get. Little close to a carry, but way to go, Plaku, for picking that up. That's really hard to get. Back row. They haven't CB East hasn't said back row at all, so really desperate. Oh, what? Oh, that was such a, that was such a, Upper Dublin right now is arguing for the fact that CB East blocker was too far over the net, but right now CB East has the point because the ref thinks that number 18, Paul Rudel, carried that ball, and he did carry that ball. He dragged it completely different direction. Oh, they're arguing about this is a really tense game. If they get this point, it's game point for CB East. 24-21 right now. Looks like CB East is getting the point. Oh, number 35 is up to serve. This is the guy with a really hard topspin serve. Let's see if he can do something here. Oh, and he goes out. Way to go, Loose. Being able to tell, great eye on that. Let's see, Upper Dublin needs at least two points right now. Right now, to tie it up. 
to make it a win by two situation. If they don't, CB East wins the set. And great serve, even better pass. Let's see if they run that middle. Oh, they did it. Oh my gosh, CB East just won the set. Oh, well, I did not expect that. Wow. I wonder if they were able to win Upper Dublin, didn't make a bunch of lineup changes, putting in some players who don't have as much experience on the court. That is very impressive for CB East, especially handling that pressure at the end in a do or die situation. Wow, I did not expect that at all. 25-22, CB East wins the third set sending the game to another set. Let's see if CB East will win the next set and make it and have the chance to win the game. Welcome back to the fourth set. I thought it was going to end in three. I thought UD was going to sweep CB East because in the first two sets, in the first two sets, Upper Dublin won 25-17 and then 25-19. But in the in the third set, the one that just happened, Upper Dublin made a few lineup changes. Communication got a little messy, and CBS ended up taking a 25-22. Really intense set, so interested to see what's going to happen here. Looks like Upper Dublin is probably going back to their normal lineup that they play. So let's see what happens. Oh. Plaku looking a little frustrated. Great pass, going to frame. Oh, really nice hit right there. 
Defender got his hands on it, but just went out of bounds. Plaku up to serve. Oh, great pass by Libero. Another really fast. Really fast up. Bang. They're saying it was a touch. They're saying it's out. We've been having a lot of, oh, Downrip saying there was a touch. This entire game, there's been a lot of controversial calls. I'd be impressed if that line ref, if that line judge managed to see a touch out, because that was a really fast hit by Pendleton, and then really hard to spot that. And Upper Dublin gets the point. They call it a touch. Also, really great job on Upper Dublin for starting to pick up on CB East middles because they run fast middles, but but aces by Black U. But the entire time, um, CB East middles have been basically throwing it to the same spot every single time. So way to go Upper Dublin for getting a block on that and putting the defenders in the right spot. Number 35 of the serve, the guy with the heavy top spin. Oh, wow. It's really hit or miss with him. Either right into the net, gets angry about it, or uh, incredible topspin serves, super hard, super powerful. Unfortunately for CBs, this time it was in the net. Nice serve, loose. Great pass by Libero. Oh, out of bounds. That hit hit the antenna for sure. No arguing on that one. Oh. Upper Dublin cheering, uh, Upper Dublin student section is getting a little loud on that one. Oh. Libero over there on CB, really good service receive, but he keeps on getting caught on those short balls that hit the tape that drop right in front of him. He keeps on going to dolphin dive instead of taking a step forward. Oh. Right there, the pass was off. The pass was off right there because he broke his platform at the last second and his angle shifted because of it. See if they target him again. Nice pass, up to Pendleton, boom, right off the hands. Feels like Upper Dublin is at his strongest when Pendleton is front row. Not to say that he's not good at defense, he's just incredible at hitting. Upper Dublin off to another fast start, 9-3. More like what they were doing in the first set. Nice pickup. Back row, let's see. Oh. 
Number 35 just isn't getting on top of the ball. Keeps on hanging out of bounds. And they serve at him. Makes sense to serve at the person when they're frustrated. Great pickup on the tips. Oh, nice push deep. Oh, great pass by the libero though. Way to get that back to target. Oh, little tip. Oh, great pickup. Let's see if they can get to it. Oh. Nice play over there. Time out, 11-3, really fast start for Robert Oblin. Let's see if CBS can start picking it up. But right now, CBS is killing themselves with their hitting errors and maybe a few service receiver errors, but mainly it's their hitting. And Upper Dublin is starting to stop CB East Middles, which are the which are the been the only hitters who have been really getting any kills at all. So it's hard to get points when your best hitters are getting stopped. Little off, little dink. Oh, keep it alive. Wow. Oh! Great play from CB East right out of the timeout. Pass was a little tight to the net. The center had no choice to dink it. Went a little far outside, but great job from number 12 to get it back over. And then, of course, the block from their middles. Incredible job. Oh, number 12. Actually, CB East as a whole trying to go back to what was working for them last set, serving short. Those short serves last set were absolutely killing Upper Dublin. Trying to go back to that, but serving it into the net. But it, you can't really be having errors when you're down 12-4. Wow! Wow! 23, oh my gosh, are you kidding? He gets a perfect pass, and then the setter sets up a slide, kills it straight down the line, into the chest of Luce. Nothing he could do about that, that was going so fast. Oh my gosh, incredible hit. Maybe they should be sending him more. Little tip, again, CB East is getting killed on those short balls. Um, looks like the endorsement went up again for the one-hand block. Didn't work for him last time. Keeps on trying it. I don't know if he's doing it on purpose or if he can't reach outside fast enough. Another short serve. Wow, what a great choice. What a great pickup. Off the hands. Great dig. Wow. Another short ball. Oh, my gosh. Now CB East is finally using their short balls against um, Upper Dublin. What a great serve, but even better pickup from Pendleton. He read the serve was going short, he dives into it, and then hits the tape, making it even shorter. Oh, what a set. Oh. Another short ball that CB just can't pick up. And number 22 is actually right there. I don't, he should have really picked it up. A little disappointing that he didn't. Oh, another roll shot. Oh, off the block. Another tool by Pendleton. 15-7, looks like a Dublin might just run away with this one.
great pass. Thought they were gonna run the middle again. Oh! Looks like it went outside of the antenna on that one. Another great pass by Libero. Try to stop the middle again. Oh, that one went out. I'm really impressed with this Libero right now. Two incredible passes in a row. The setter didn't even have to move his feet. And of course on the second one, second perfect pass, they tried to run the middle, but Yudi is on that middle right now. They are putting a double block up against him. He just can't do anything about it. Frame tight. Come on, let's see if they can pick up the tip. Oh, wow. CB East really needs to work on getting their tips. Especially since that tip went line and Frayne has only hit line once this entire game. Oh. N number 12 gets the kill. Number eight from CBE subbing in, I believe this is his first time. Let's see what he's got. Unless I'm mistaken, but let's see what he's got. Another short serve. A misconnect on middle. Oh, Potter Rudel is in. Great set. Oh, way to pick that off off the block. Roll shot, let's see if they can pick it up. They do. Middle, another tight ball. Wow. Great play right now. Looks like a, oh my gosh. One thing CB East is good at is their block. Incredible job up at the net from both teams. Wow, what a strong block. CB East again trying to get up or doubling on the short serves. This time doesn't work, goes into the net. Number 35 back in, oh. They just put number eight in, so number 35 wouldn't serve. I guess they didn't, they couldn't trust the serve right now because he's been a little inconsistent and right now it's do or die. 18-10, Upper Dublin. Loose up to serve. Great serve. Oh, high off the hands. Oh, really a tight ball tip. Oh, they actually picked the tip up. Great pursuit by Libero. Simple free ball over. Let's see what they do with the free ball. Pendleton crushes that ball. Deep corner. I love the hustle from Libero though on that one, but it's starting to look a little grim for CB East right now. Oh, pass was a little tight. Number 22 from CB East tried to pull it off the net, didn't work. And if he tried to go up and attack the ball, number 18, Potter Rudel was right there to slant, shut it down. Great serve. Oh, what a dick. Oh! Two people up at the net. Against the one. Number 21, Libero up to serve. Wow. Pendleton up to serve. With Pendleton back row. This is CBE's best chance of getting back in the game. Oh, great spot, right on the right on the end line. Great spot, nice shot. 
Those ones are always hard to get, especially since CBS has been making so many hitting errors. It's easy to assume that when it's going deep, they just assume it's going out. Little misconnect. Looks like nobody knew what was going on there. Another misconnect from CB East. That would have been a perfect chance for them to score. Oh! Pendleton from back row, but he hits it into the net. Let's see if uh, CB East can mount a comeback right now. See if they go short again. Yes, they will. Plaku there for it. Another roll shot straight into the block. Great cover by number 18. Pendleton, they go back row. Pendleton again. He gets another hitting error, this time hitting it long. Another short serve. Oh! Tool right off the block. Upper Dublin is hype. 22 14. Upper Dublin is up by eight right now. They sub Watt in. Let's see what he's got. Into the net, unfortunate. And he's coming back out immediately. Number 23, up to serve. Oh, into the net. Two more points and Upper Dublin seals the game. And Scott Barenbaum is up to serve. Let's see if he can end it right here and right now. Or maybe CB East goes on a massive um, eight point comeback. That'd be pretty impressive if they did that. Oh, a little roll shot, out of system, really tight ball. Let's see. Oh, looks like 12 knew that uh, what ball was going out, but he couldn't get out of the way fast enough. Nice out of system play from Red Dublin. This is game points. They win this game over. Tops it. Oh, oh, Whoa, that was. Barenbaum had like a foot over the line. Looks like the line ref wasn't gonna call that one. Maybe a little bias towards Upper Dublin. I'm glad the ref caught it though. Another short serve. Trying their luck right now. Push. Come on, let's see. Don't end on hitting air. Oh! CVs gets the kill. Still in it, 24-17. I wouldn't be surprised if... Oh, another short serve, wow. Let's see who they're gonna go to. Theo Dorson seals the deal. There you have it. That is actually the score. The, the first set was 25-17. So the first set was 25-17, Upper Dublin. 25-19, Upper Dublin. 25-22, CB East. 25-17, Upper Dublin. Overall, great showing for UD. Solid win, three to one. Love to see it. Thank you all for watching. Uh, Upper Dublin Boys Varsity Volleyball versus CB East Patriots, and have a good night.